What up, cut ups? So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about fake beefs. And I have noticed quite some time ago too, um, that some of these YouTube channels are really, instead of having beef with channels, different channels that they're supposed to not like, um, the beef appears to me to be fake. Because why would you want to keep talking about people that are just basic and very boring? Um, unless it's some type of a secret plot or plan for, you know, all of these channels to get together and, you know, really um, just try to make these channels relevant to keep them in the YouTube algorithm. Okay, so to speak, because that's what it appears like to me. Like, I know that these people, I've watched them. Matter of fact, I'm related to one. They are very, very boring, honey. And I know that if it wasn't for some of these channels out here that keep talking about him and them, keep hashtagging their name. Okay, check that out. Just check that out for what it's worth. Let's just break some of these titles down, okay? You're supposed to have so much beef with these people that you're talking about, but you keep hashtagging their names. To me, that, that right there don't even make sense. To me, it don't. So, I just wanted to bring that up. Definitely talk about that. Because, yeah, um, it's like, are y'all, somebody paying y'all? Now, I'm just asking, you know, what's the purpose? Is some type of secret plot as to why... Um, is continuous fake beef with boring people. Um, what's going on with that? Can anybody break that down? Give me some feedback. Come on, cut ups. Let's let's try to put this together because I'm really confused. Okay. And yes, I have mentioned it before. I, I really, I really have. I, I brought this up before because, man, it's almost like. <laughs> Evil people doing things to be spiteful, which I feel some of that too. Yeah, you mean, or I mean to just keep talking about the same people. These people, I'm just feeling like, yeah, it's, it's some type of a connection somehow, somewhere, you know, instead of really hating these people or despising these people you know like you some of you channels want the world to think i don't think it's that at all you know it's, it's it's some other stuff going on here some other things at play here and i'm not the only one that said it. somebody left a comment on my channel and said the same thing just i think it was yesterday or on today's video i think it was yesterday's but yeah it ain't mm, oh and another channel that was actually talking about it, and y'all can go check her out, is Unspoken Truth. Okay. Is it Unspoken Truth or unspoke, Unspoken Purpose? It's one of those two, y'all. I'm not sure. Unspoken Purpose. One or the other. Go listen to a video. It's like it's, I think it's her recent video. And she's talking about the same thing I'm saying. You know, unspoken purpose. Something like that, y'all. Yeah. Unspoken truth. Sorry about that, but yeah. Um, she's, she appears to be, you know, on the ball. Uh, as far as, you know. Now, I don't know about, you know, talk about people and all the other stuff that, you know, she may have her own reasons for doing that. But I know her talking about um, using people. Um, to keep them relevant and to keep them in the YouTube algorithm. She talks about that and she ain't lying. I definitely feel there's some truth to that. So, you know, at any rate, at the end of the day, of course, channels are going to talk about, you know, what they want to talk about. And that's y'all prerogative. But just don't think that people don't see what y'all uh, doing, some of y'all doing out here. Because it's, it's it's been going on so long that it's just... You know, you start to think something. Like, come on. You clearly see these motherfuckers are boring. But you keep talking about them. 
Was it reason? Somebody paying y'all? What's going on? I'm very, and really, I ain't being shady right now. I'm very curious. I'd sure like to know. So yeah, cut up. So I'm gonna need y'all once again to help me break this one down. You know, and don't take it the wrong way. You know, to certain channels out there. You know, don't don't take it personal. I ain't trying to out nobody, but at the same time, yes, I am. You know, just not specifically because I feel like people know who they are. You know, and I feel like the people that are on YouTube, you know, on a daily basis or at least a regular basis, know who these people are too. So, I mean, it's so much going on in this damn world. Interesting shit. Uh, uh, <laughs> interesting people. Uh, a lot more interesting places to go. You know, uh, interesting foods to try. Shit, it's too much going on. Like, live a little life, ladies and people. Live a little life. Do something different. Yeah, that's my challenge to anybody out there that, that's stuck. Just stuck and stagnated on certain irrelevant people's channels. So... There you go. Feel how you want to feel. Now, I, I done said it. Yeah, I sure enough did. Should have been. Well, matter of fact, I did mention it. I, I don't remember which video. But I sure mentioned it because it's just been very suspicious to me for quite some time. For quite some time. Okay. But anywho, enough of that, y'all. I'm slowly finding things that my baby will eat. Okay. So, the chicken, boiling the chicken, a couple people told me about, you know, told me to do that. I appreciate y'all for that, because y'all was right. Um, I did chicken breast yesterday. I did drumsticks today and boiled it, you know, and, and the dog did eat it, y'all. I tried to put a pill. Matter of fact, I put it up here. Here it go. Try to put this little pill that he's supposed to take in the piece of chicken, y'all. This dog is smart, and I cannot get mad at him because he's smart. I want him to be smart. Okay? But y'all, this little pill is his um, um, doxycycline that he's supposed to take every 12 hours. And, you know, it's like, I, I, I don't know what to do. I've, I've tried crushing it, breaking it down yesterday because he was eating eggs so good. Made him some eggs. And I, I'm thinking I'm really being slick. So, because I, I crushed it down into a powder. And put it in the eggs when I cooked it, y'all. He ain't eat them damn eggs. He's smart. <laughs> and I can't fool him, y'all. I don't know what to do. I mean, maybe I should suggest a different type of a medication from the vet. You know, because he's off his, um, this, he's off of this prescription. I don't know what else to do to make him take this. I wish it was something that like a treat that you can put a pill or something like this inside like not like like i've been doing it i will take a knife like i did a piece of the chicken breast and i'll slit it and stuff this pill in there real deep thinking is deep that don't work that dog know the difference and what he'll do he'll take it out of my hand but he'll set it on the floor Almost like it, to inspect it, y'all. Like he inspected it. He's super smart. So, yeah, I, I got to come up with another suggestion for um, that. And, and, and y'all, another thing, too. The vet that I was taking him to, which have his eye drops right now. You know, I didn't feel comfortable giving him eye drops. He's new, I, and I don't want to have any issues getting bit. Like the lady who took his temperature in his butt. He grazed her arm, okay. And um, the next day when I saw her, it was swollen, you know, purple and pink, you know, it, it was swollen, purple and blue. But um, I'm not getting a bit. That's why I, I <laughs> that's why I'll take him and let them do it. They're supposed to be the professionals, but y'all, when I took him yesterday, the vet there. They had a real tough time. I mean, for one, he only getting one eye drop in one eye. That's it. Y'all yeah, was there for over half an hour. My baby was in the back barking and barking. And you know what? Yeah. Hey, y'all. The next thing I knew, and that's how I know I'm getting protective over him, too. 
because I was sitting in the waiting area. The next thing I know, I was back there where he was at. I found some door where I just listened to where I heard his voice and I went in that direction. I opened that damn door up when he went back there. It was the vet and two of the ladies. They was trying to calm him down. He kept barking. They couldn't do it. And I was like, what's going on? And the vet said, he's being naughty. And I'm like, okay, but this is your damn job. Damn. You know, what, what type of maneuvers do y'all have? Shit, do some of that shit. You know, that's how I feel. Like, damn. It's one lady there, real pretty tall lady, Jen. Her name's Jen. She's so sweet. And she's real good with him. And I really only wanted her to do it. Now that I see that the vet don't know what the hell he doing. Um, I, I'll stick with just her doing it. So, yeah. But I'm still going to just ask, you know, for maybe a liquid form of just, I don't know. Something that's tasteless, but I don't know, y'all. Y'all know I'm new to this, but I'm learning. But anyway, y'all, stay tuned. And if y'all have any ideas out there on how to hide a pill in your pet's food when they are taking medication, please let me know. Y'all have been really helpful with the tips and the hints for Smiley. So thank y'all. I appreciate it. And to the little like, share, comment, and subscribe.